One of the most advanced main battle tanks in the world is undoubtedly Israel's Merkava. On September 19, 2023, after five years of development, the Israeli Ministry of Defense introduced the next generation of the Merkava series. So, in this video, we're taking a closer look at it and exploring some of its new features. Let's dive right in. Nicknamed the Barak, which translates to lightning in Hebrew, the next generation of the Merkava main battle tank focuses on technological advancements rather than structural changes. This includes the integration of cutting-edge sensors, small cameras, artificial intelligence, advanced networking, and an active protection system. As a result, it is regarded as an enhanced iteration of the Merkava 4, although its official designation is Merkava Mark 5. As with earlier versions, the Barak MBT was jointly developed by the Defense Ministry's Armored Vehicles Directorate, also known as MANTAC, and the Israeli Defense Forces. The MOD released a video showing three completed Barak MBTs and announced that the first new tanks were already delivered to the 52nd Battalion of the 401st Armored Brigade in early September 2023. Externally, the Barak tank appears quite similar to its predecessor, the Merkava 4, with the chassis, engine, automotive components, and the majority of the armor, remaining largely unaltered. The real innovation primarily lies in enhancements related to sensors, electronic systems, and software and artificial intelligence, created by various Israeli defense firms, such as Elbit Systems, Rafael, and the Israel Aerospace Industries Elta subsidiary, among others. Now, let's explore some of the new systems featured on the Barak MBT. Elbit Systems takes a central role in enhancing the Barak's electronics by contributing to the development of the new C4I system and improving situational awareness. Major enhancements include advanced sites with integrated AI for autonomous target identification, a faster and more accurate fire control system, and a user-friendly human-machine interface with smartphone-like touchscreens. The Barak tank is capable of integrating data from onboard sensors and features the new day and night helmet system, called Iron Vision. This 360 degree camera system, similar to a fighter jet pilot's helmet, enables quick target identification and prioritization using AI based algorithms. Elbit Systems' involvement extends beyond electronics. They are also responsible for supplying the 120mm gun, along with an improved fire control system that enhances the tank's precision for day and night operations and extends firing ranges. In terms of survivability, the active protection system on the Barak takes on a crucial role against kinetic threats. Raphael's trophy system, also known as the Windbreaker, is the chosen APS for the Barak tank, with the same system already integrated into older Merkava tanks and Namer armored personnel carriers. The Trophy APS comprises a radar detection system that identifies incoming missiles, anticipates their flight paths, and launchers that release metal pellets, effectively redirecting missiles or rockets away from the tank. According to the European Defense Review magazine, the Trophy system's adaptability to emerging threats relies on annual software updates that enhance its capabilities. The latest version is not only equipped to counter current threats, but is also primed to handle future ones by integrating machine learning and AI. The Merkava has served as the IDF's primary battle tank since the 1980s. In recent years, the Armored Corps phased out most of its Merkava Mark III models in favor of the more modern Mark IV, introduced in 2003. Similarly, the Barak is slated to eventually take on the role of the Armored Corps' primary battle tank in the following decade or so. What do you think? Let's discuss in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for the latest defense news and analyses.